Hi bro, uh, thank you for uh, welcoming us here. Uh, and I hope uh, exactly a year back uh, I called you for the studio of us. Yeah. We have completed one year in uh, YouTube now and uh, it's an anniversary for us also. So please explain what are the new stocks that I have made and new features, new stocks. And I can see there are a lot of uh, new changes going on, new plans, new setups are being kept. So please explain us all about that and go to you. Sure. Uh, first of all, thank you so much, Ashwan, for making video again. So I remember one year back you did come and make a video and it was a good success too. And it's been one year and you're doing good, which is amazing. And for people who don't know me, my name is Hafiz. I am a proprietor in a place called uh, Wow Aquatics in Bangalore. So basically, I deal with fishes, but not just fishes, monster fishes. Okay, so any person who is looking for a monster fish, what is a monster fish? A big fish which eats other fishes, who likes big fishes can contact me anytime. I am one of the best guys to let you know about any fish which is big. Basically, I deal with monsters like Arowana, snakeheads, giant gourami, all big, big sizes. These fishes are actually... Yeah, big. massive they are. I have are big pakus. These are all two feet, easily two feet. You actually look what at the. What fish is that one? It looks so elegant. Yeah, and this is actually a snakehead. Yeah, yeah we I call it Chenna diplograma. I have seen it other side, uh, different places also. But yeah. that blue color which this has is very unique color. Very uh, true. That's that's the reason uh, you need to visit Wow Aquatics. Yeah. Okay, we have the best quality fishes. If you look at the snakehead that you were speaking about, you see the coloration. Versus the coloration that you've seen so far, yeah. this would be the best fishes. I get them in small sizes too. Yeah. I sell them at any size you want, depending on customer's requirement, we do the need. But that doesn't mean that it should be a very big fish for everybody. We can buy it in small size and... Correct. So depending on the customer's requirement, basically, oh. we do everything. We also do big, big tanks. I have two new setups going on here for my display now. So I do big tanks as well. So this all depends on the customer's requirement. Any place in Bangalore, we do uh, the tanks. But when it comes to fishes, we send it throughout India. So we ship any place you want. But the only thing is they should have a railway station there or a bus stand so that we can go ahead and send them the fishes. And when it comes to shipping, we also give them low, uh, sorry, live arrival guarantee. So any person who is looking for a fish, don't get scared that he is going to send it in a box and you are going to get a dead fish. No, we send you fish with the live arrival guarantee. The only thing we ask for is a, a what you call an unboxing video. If you could share that, then your money guarantee is always there. You can trust Wow Aquatics on that. People always get confused. How do I make my uh, fishes get sold? Uh, to be honest, we don't have something called as an advertisement or anything that we do. I only have a YouTube group. Okay, any person who is interested can join my group. You will regularly get a uh, yeah, WhatsApp group. So you will regularly get my stock updates, whatever you're interested, depending on uh, the requirement, we send it across. That's how it works. And I could see that you are, uh, you are in the top search in India for uh, aquariums uh, when all, it comes to all aquatics. Uh, Okay. All right. Hey, thanks, man. Thanks, thanks, yeah. thanks. That's and only because of the monster fishes, monster. maybe. Yeah. You particularly deal with monster. Fishes. Correct. My my primary objective is monster fishes. Oh, so so grooming, everything. You everything. Do. Yes, yes. I have yeah, also started a grooming section now. Yeah. So we are growing as per the customer's requirement. Now my base is increased. My customers have increased. So I need to give all the customers the needful things, right? And basically, I don't just get the fishes and sell them. What I do is I quarantine them and then sell them. So I would need so many tanks, you know. Usually the dealers do buy fishes and immediately give them off to the customers, which is not my priority, you know. My priority is to acclimate them, quarantine them and sell them. That's why I have this customer base. See, what, one thing I can tell you is around 100 meters around your company, you can see a lot of them. Yeah. What literally beats you up is the coloration of the fish and the quality of the fish. Even if you see chiclets there, their color is very good. Yeah, if you and actually go through my tanks, right? Pop, right? Yeah, these are all Malawi high grade chiclets. Their color also very good. Yeah, these are all imported batches. Yeah. So I get different batches. 
I also sell, sell Indian fish. See, if you actually look at this tank, this is all South American chiclets. So I have uh, wedge, uh, Argentina. People look for these fishes. They don't find it in Bangalore, usually in shops. Very I, rare yeah, very rare. I also have electric blue akara, red spotted severums. I also have fire mouth. Yeah, all mixed chiclets. In this tank, if you actually look at it, these are all called blue dolphin chiclets. Dolphin chiclets. Yeah, again a rare pattern chiclet. So people look for this kind of chiclets. Yeah, I think that was not. So last time I think we had this one. Like, yeah, like yeah if you actually look at this tank, right, you will see different type of uh, geophagus variety too. So you look at that particular variety is at a good size actually. They are six inches. They are called as redhead topogers. I also have them with discus. I have them with a rare variety spotted azul blue. This one, right? Yeah. So I have a 24k gold in that tank too, arowana. So I keep getting fishes. I also have detnoids. So many people don't know what detnoid is. So this is called as an Indonesian tiger. They are still in stress, but usually a very beautiful fish. And in aquarium hobby, most uh, looked after fish for monster fishes. So I have that upside down nice catfish. Upside yeah. So I have them in different sizes. I'm just showing you samples here. So I mean, any person. I see that uh, this uh, this fish are here with the uh, bass and all. That's only because I'm a seller. <laughs> you won't see it in an obvious no, place. Yeah. yeah, I am a seller and I, I take care of the fish as well. I I feed them well and I keep rocks and everything so that they don't fight. So that is taken care that's here. That too, they are very calmly in this place. Yeah, they are actually well Even said, right? Vibe, right? Yeah, true, yeah. true, true. Even the tank is <laughs> very, very good. And uh, so, see, mainly what I deal with is monsters, right? See, people look for big, big size parrot fishes, right? So they don't know where to get them from because they already have a big size arona. They want to match the size. Look at this size. Yeah. So I, I have them in small as well. I'll show you that. Uh, it might look smaller in this video, but they are massive really actually. This is actually a four feet, three feet, three feet. Four feet, two feet, three feet. Three feet. Right. See, look at the red tail cats. People looking for big red tail cats. If you look at there, I have big uh, tiger, shovel nose, red tail cats, rare plecos, everything available. Oscars. This is a red tail Jain gourami. People looking for a rare variety, Jain Gorami. I have them in sizes. This is not the actual size that start from. This is good one feet cut thing. So I have and, them in uh, different you sizes. Right? Last we show them that uh, one rare variety which you have the catfish. Platinum uh -huh. catfish. Platinum, yeah, I'll actually show you that as well. See, these are all gars. People look for gars. As uh, you know, I'm known for monster awesome. fishes. Yeah. So gars are always available with me. So these are all regular pakus people look for, red belly pakus, albino pakus, these are jaguars. So jaguar is again a South American chiclet. So if you look at uh, razor, most sought of fish is uh, in monster hobby is uh, arapaima. People look for arapaima. I think I no one sells this in Bangalore. Until yeah. this I have not seen in many shops. Mm -hmm. not this again a rare variety yeah. fish. So people looking for rare variety, you know whom to contact me. Just what call size me. does this arapaima get? Up to so the one that you're looking at now is around 12 inches. Okay. So this gets up to eight eight feet. Oh, it's wow. a good pond fish. A really very big. See, size. that's a Enlicheri Senegal. So I have it in sizes. It starts from a three inch with me. The one that you're looking at is around 11, 12 inch. And more sort after again, red tail catfish. I have it in sizes Which, and even though monster fish you have in every size yeah big. so I, I uh, cater to the customer's need so it's an albino arowana this is a RTG this all comes with certificate so that is a crossback 24k gold everything comes with a certificate with me I also have so these are all the snow white morphs and uh, red parrots, yellow parrots, all A grade stuff. And this I have them in see. sizes. What I, what I want to do, sorry for stopping you. Mm -hmm. I go to a lot of aquariums. See, here what he has added is, uh, for viewers, it is a normal LED. Uh, normal light, light, yeah. But see the color of this fish. Yeah, that's the reason I told you it's, it's an A grade stuff. Yeah. 
I don't sell regular stuff. A grade, with quality, all imported batch. This is a Snow White Moor. You, you usually outside, right? mm -hmm. orange. It will be an orange color. Or when they grow, they lose the color and things like that, right? This one are mm -hmm. damn red color. Damn red. A very nice quality fishes. As I told you before, I quarantine them and then sell them. So on this setup, I'm getting two alligator guards ready. They are actually in a dim water. You cannot see them in this. They are all huge, two feet big. So they are getting ready for my new tank. On this one, new yeah, tank. yeah, yeah. So in this, if you actually look at Senegal's, so I have different variety Senegal's. The one that you're looking at is an albino. Albino Senegal, the one which came in now is a green Senegal. I have Delhazy, I have Edli Cherry, four different patterns in Senegal's Baicher. So that is a giant gourami, small. This is not a normal giant gourami, this is a red tail giant gourami. I also have albino giant gouramis, which I'll show you. And uh, if you actually look at the most sorted fishes here, yeah, these are all Oscars. These are all Indian Oscars available in good 4 to 5 inch size. I always have them in stock. Currently, I have it in lots of uh, different sizes. Here, if you see big size uh, tinfoil, albino tinfoil bobs, and uh, I also have uh, albino red eye giant gourami. These all grow big. I also have sea angel, different types of fishes always clubbed in. We got new stock of uh, Yeah, one, right? right time you walked in, I just got my imported uh, stock, which I'll show you. I'm about to release them. So usually it comes with a package like this. Okay, they fill it with oxygen. I sell send fishes like this. See, what we? Just show it. Okay. Yeah. I just want to show you. Yeah, without Actually, light. No huh? light, nothing. See the color. In normal light only. It's so bright red. Right? Yeah. Now we, we, they release that into the water. You can see so that. usually I don't release the fishes uh, as soon as I get them. I acclimate them. So what I do is I soak them in the water like this. We call it as floating. So I keep all my packets there. So they get floated for some time. Then the acclimation begins. Yeah. So with that light, now the color is... Yeah, it's, it's a different shade altogether. Yeah, I have also given a very good number. Yeah, I usually get a lot. I have so many customers looking for this kind of fish. I keep getting my stock. And the setup also looks, looks good, right? Mm, yeah. This is 7 feet tank, right? This is actually ultra clear setup. It runs in a, some filtration. Oh. You also do this sort of setup set right? Yeah, yeah. Also, that is very uh, small size also. People look for small size. Just to give you a praise, I usually don't tell my prices, but these are all 150 pair. Very reasonable pricing. Based on the size, right? Yeah, based on the size, the prices go. And based on the quality as well. If we are getting the imported lot, no, then the price is different. See, that's a sorted fish. You actually look at that fish. It's called as a clown knife. I have different types of clowns available. I have a clown loach, everything available. Not showing every fish in this video, but yeah, most sorted fishes I'm showing. Oh, please. How do you recommend us to keep these tanks clean? Because your tanks. See, look tank at the filtration. Clean. I put canisters in my tanks. Samsung, right? Yeah, that runs on a 3000 HW canister, that tank. These two tanks are running on a 304B with a UV. So for it is better to have a canister, canister or, or a sump, yeah. To make your life easy. It's not required that you need to have this. If you are good in your cleaning, cleaning then yeah. What is the dimension of these tanks which you have in This is a 5 2 by 2. 5 by 2 by 2. 2 by 2, yeah. I have a couple of tanks which I just got. So we know. make these tanks, okay. So I'll invite you when I'm making a new tank so that you can share it with the customers as well. I think uh, you also are now starting this grooming setup, right? Correct. So, basically all monster fishes will be groomed by me only here. Yeah? 
which is actually good because they get set in Indian water only. So usually when you get them from outside, what happens is the water change, things can go wrong. But when it comes to our own grooming, no, that won't go wrong. So how do you recommend me? If I want to come into this hobby, master aquarium hobby, should I go? What is the minimum size of fish which we should take? Is, is it better to take a large fish and maintain it up? Uh, or to go with small one and to raise it to be a See, to answer that, I'll not answer it here. I'll take you downstairs yeah. to show you even single fishes can be monsters. Okay, come down, I'll show you. There are multiple flows of fishes, right? Yes. So if you actually look at this, no? Most sorted fish in the hobby. Every person wants one, right? So this, look at the head that I have. Okay, these are all AAA grade monster cocks in SRD. I have it in different grades. See, small ones, people looking for uh, fries or uh, even a uh, small head pop kind of a thing. I have it sorted. Yeah, so that's a kamfa, classic kamfa available. Look at the head for this one as well. So I have good grades available. So people looking for a single fish to start. Hey, this is a good fish to start as well. What is the size of tank you recommend for uh, flower on sea? Flower on sea depends on the customer's requirement. Uh, fry and all can be taken care in one particular uh, size, let's say two feet. But uh, good. Uh, As it grows, we should. Growth, yeah. I would always recommend a three by one and a half by one and a half. Yeah, these are all uh, a small oh, monster. Is I, I like beetles, man. They are also monsters, according to me. People will not agree. Yeah, small scale. Yeah, they cannot be kept with other fishes. Yeah, yeah. I have different ones. Crown tail. Crown tail yeah. I have it in uh, different. Uh, what do you call genders as yeah. well? Male, female, yeah. and all. Large number of monsters. Correct. And see, monster, yeah, my monster. basic. So I have uh, different type of catfishes. These Just are all parun sharks. Right? You would have seen the regular sharks everywhere, right? These are parun sharks. Parun sharks. Yeah. So they grow huge as well. They required meat too. Oh. See, this is a hybrid shovel nose. These are all rare. Hybrid shovel nose. Look at this one. He's a show quality red tail. He is easily two feet. What is the age of this? He is around three and a half, I believe. Three and a half, four, yeah. So pakus, goramis. Big uh, silver. I'll show you one more tank where I have. This is actually a 5 2 by 3. Yeah. Even this is a monster. Again, runs in a sum. It's a beautiful tank. I have uh, all the other fishes as well. It's not that I only deal with monster. Monster is my uh, base, main. And the other things also I deal with. I get all fishes. Yeah, I have birds, I have everything available. A person who wants to visit and have a nice time, visit my shop. You will love it. Okay, you should see them live. That's when you will understand what I'm speaking about. Look at that. He is actually this big. These guys are massive. Okay. You usually see them in uh, exhibition, I believe. But I'll show you one more rare variety. Look at that guy there. He's hiding. He's camera shy. <laughs> so that guy is called Platinum Retail. Very rare. Very few people have this in Bangalore. See, these are all my albino aronas. I like albino, so I've kept an albino tank. So these are all albinos. A personal fish. Yeah, uh, this is a beautiful fish, a platinum red tail cat. It's an expensive fish. It's not common in the hobby. People looking for rare stuff can also contact. Is what I'm trying to say. Exotic. Yeah, exotic stuffs. You get it. This tank also looks very good. Yeah. What size is this? This tank? is again a 5 feet tank. Two albinos. Yeah. Usually it's very hard to see two albinos together. They yeah. fight. But mine I've got along good. These Thank are God. Paired, huh? These are actually paired, yeah. Looking for good results, hopefully. Yeah. <laughs> so in that case, as I said, any person who's looking for a fish can join my group. 
I'll tell Yashwan to add my uh, chat uh, in the description. You can just click on the link and get my group up updates regularly. It's a beautiful very, fish, very no? Good. Yeah, when he grows, you should see him. Massively grows. Very good pattern. This is already around 11, 12 inch now. Okay, with that note, I would like to close this video. Thank you so much, Ashwan, for making this video come true again. Uh, any questions, like I said, uh, you can call me, message me, do whatever, get in touch with me. If you are from Bangalore, please do visit my shop. You will love this experience. Trust me, you will love. It's not that only fishes I have. I have dogs, I have cats. I deal with majorly everything which is legal. Okay, yeah, like a pet kingdom, yes. Uh, please do visit my shop from Bangalore if you are. Otherwise, you can call me, get in touch with me. As I said, WhatsApp group, live updates, you would keep getting it. Anything and everything, you can call me only regarding fishes. Thank and you. Your shop address and phone contact. Number. Sure, my shop you can actually Google it. It's Wow Aquatics, Bangalore. You will come right in front of my shop if you follow the directions. To make it simpler, you come to GT Mall, Bangalore. Behind GT Mall is where my shop is located. My shop is in first and second floor, basically. So that's about Wow Aquatics. So thank you again. Thank you so much. Thank you so much.